Hello again, this is Falkas with the second part of the tutorial how to use Weapon Delivery Planner in a technical engagement multiplayer environment. This time I'll be pretending to be the client part or the wingman side of the, the mission and as you can see here on the left hand side I just received the package of the files that the mission commander has sent to me and I'll just extract them and have a look and here are the three files. So, two of the files were the pictures of the data card and you see I have exactly the same information as all the rest of the people in my flight and also have the coordination card with all the information needed right here and you'll see uh, the last file that's the mission.ini file which is actually the data cartridge file that we use at this time this data cartridge file needs to be put at the correct place and for that you have to navigate to your BMS installation and you find the directory called data in this you'll go to your theater directory in this case it uh, will be a default career directory so we go to campaign and we go to the safe directory this location is of course dependent on which theater you fly and the ini files need to go in the same place where all the other mission files are being saved for that theater. So just grab the ini file and just drop it over in the correct location. That's all you need to do. Next thing uh, you just start up BMS. As so here we are. We we'll just uh, jumped into the mission online. We're just uh, going to navigate to the correct flight here. It was the F-16 flights of Kunsan Air Base and Cowboy 1. And you see here already in Falcon, we have our tanker track, we have our pre-planned threads and we have our line steer points. And do notice that we did not touch any buttons, we did not load anything. Everything is ready, the time is running and the only thing we have to do is hit the fly button and enjoy the mission. I'll go to runway and speed up the process a little bit. So we just entered the cockpit and we're on the runway. Let's have a quick look if everything has loaded. You see if you go to taxi you don't need to load the data cartridge by hand anymore. You see the tanker track here. Let's zoom in a little bit. There we go. You see we have the tanker track as a line, we have our float line and we have all our steer points as a line. And that's all you need to do. Enjoy the flights!